Hey, son, you off to school? Yes, Mom. Uh, I gotta hurry before the bus leaves. You know that you always wake up late. Just in case, grab your skateboard. Okay, Mom. Bye. Love you. <sighs> Guess I'm taking my skateboard after all. Ugh, what do you guys want? Just hand over your money, you know the drill. Yeah, well here soon. Give us the money or else there's gonna be some problems. Look, I know you guys are bullies, but that doesn't mean I have to fear you. You should, because we're about to give you quite a pounding. Well, bye. Get back here! Let's go get him. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I can't go back to school because they probably beat me there. Those guys are fast when they're trying to catch their prey. Mm, I'll just find some place to hang and then go to school later. I just need to hurry up and find some place where I can hang. Just in case they follow me into the forest. Like a cave or something. That will do. They may be tough, but they want to follow me there. Oh. Perfect. This will be a great place to hide. Might as well find some place to hide in here, just in case they are brave enough to go in. Hello, if you're watching this, that means you are now the new dimension now. The protector and guardian of the entire multiverse. Use your powers well, and use your powers wisely. The fate of the multiverse rests on your shoulders. Where the heck am I? And what is that thing? I can... I can feel something happening. Hello there, I'm Dee Dee. Okay Dee Dee, what in the world's happening? How did I get here? And what's the deal with the staff? That is the staff of the Dimensionals, as you must have heard from on the recording of the original Dimensional. You see, Dimensionals are the being that protects the multiverse from threats you would say is not from their world. It's their job to keep order and make sure the universe stays how the universe is. Since you and you found the staff, you are now the new Dimensional, which means it's your destiny to protect the entire multiverse from all evil threats that may invade it. I will have to feed you in on more information later. You have to get back to your class, don't you? As much as I really want to know how did you know that, yes, I really need to get to the class. So can you just portal me or whatever you did to me to bring me here in the first place? Sure thing, just gonna do this, press that there, and you're ready to go. Ah, uh, she messed something up. I'm outside the cave. She was supposed to teleport me back to school. Ah, uh, whatever, I have to get my skateboard back anyway. But this staff, I just wish I could shrink it. Oh, well that works. Sorry I'm late, I had a little trouble getting here. I don't really care what it was, just go take a seat. Don't think I forgot, I don't know about what you did, Jaden. No one runs away from me and gets away with it. Understand that? I heard that. You know I don't, uh, don't like bullying. 
Whatever conflict you two have it together, go talk it over with the prison principal and get it over with. I heard that. You know I don't, uh, don't like bullying. Whatever conflict you two have it together, go talk it over with the prison principal and get it over with. Listen to me, kids. You need to stop fighting. You need to focus more on school. Everything we do here in school is to prepare us for the future. Because you see, each single class is just a step up to life. Soon you will, it will be Egan and Jobs and Jaden. Jaden! Jaden! Huh? Yeah, what is it? What? Nothing, nothing. Listen to me, Jaden. There is a Megatron outside. You need to get out. Out. I don't care what it is. Just get out there and deal with it before it decides to destroy your whole school. Listen, I really have to go. It's an emergency. Something came up. Please, can I go? Hmm. This just sounds like an excuse. Why should I let you go? I don't have time to explain. I'll give you an explanation. Just please let me go. It's an emergency. Fine, but I do want that explanation. You're dismissed. Thanks. Okay, I'm ready. Where is it? It should be apparent any second. Okay, just one more problem. I, I can't just let people come out here and see me battling this thing. I need disguise. I'll beam you one. Just activate your powers and the suit will just appear. Got that? Yes. I like the suit, but how is it supposed to protect my identity? It doesn't even cover my face. Think of it as Superman and his glasses. The suit you're wearing has a magical spell that protects you, our identity. Anyone that knows you will think you're someone completely different. The tank is on its way. Let's see how this tank likes a little fire. What happened? The spell is only as strong as you think it is. Thinking of it as just a normal fireball does nothing. Besides, it's fireproof anyway. You need to think ink up some other way to defeat it. You have millions of cartoon characters. Little do you know that all those cartoon characters you watch are actually beings from other dimensions. Think of using their powers and you can do it as well. Okay. A hey, Sonic has experience with fighting robots. Let's try here. Target too fast. Unequip with a type of tools to eliminate. Let's see if this hunger junk knows how to take an overload. System reaching critical mask. Overload, overload, overload. Huh. I expected for this to be a little bit harder. I have no idea who you are or where you came from, but uh, we all saw that. Thank you so much for taking care of that tank thing. This whole school is in your thanks. Yeah, man, you are awesome. I wish I was like you. Well, now I know how Spider-Man fell with Flash. Well, before I became a big fan, I just hope that maybe he'll become friends with me, at least the normal me. Anyway, hey, you're all welcome, but I gotta go and... Listen to me, child, and listen to me good. Just because you got the powers and the most powerful being in the entire multiverse does not mean that you do know how to use them. I'm coming for you, your family, and everyone you love. Be afraid. Be very afraid of me. 
Hey, Diddy, can I ask you a question? Sure. What's your question about? Well, well after I stopped Tinkor, I had a vision about this guy wearing orange. He said that he would see me very soon. <sighs> All you need to know is he's the one who sent the tank. He is one of the enemies you're supposed to fight, but no need to worry about him. Just go, okay? I knew who was going to meet with him. I just hoped it wasn't this soon. You did good, my champion. He has no idea what's up next. Glad that I can help.